You guys should feel special because I actually put a real shirt on for you guys. Hi guys, Jean here and welcome back to my channel. And today I'm going to do another uh, Coupons Made Me Buy This. Um, you guys really liked uh, my last video on the Maybelline Colossal Volume Mascara. So I'm going to go ahead and um, do another video for you guys. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're enjoying my content. I post um, deal videos uh, primarily with CVS and Target. And then I also have a Fit Friday series where I'm documenting my uh, Weight Watchers journey. And then I post um, other random videos um, whenever I get a chance to actually upload them. So I have a pretty full upload schedule. I try to upload um, as much as I can. So I hope you guys stick around, subscribe to my channel, and let's just go ahead and get into the video. So today I'm gonna to be talking about the Rimmel London uh, Sculpting Contour Palette. And this is the Kate Moss collection. And I got mine at Target, um, not a big surprise there. And it actually comes in um, three different shades. You have um, one for um, light skin tones, there's a medium, and then there is a um, golden bronze for um, darker skin tones. So um, this was priced at $6.49 over at my Target, and there is currently still a printable $2 off coupon. So when you use the $2 off Target coupon, this is going to come down to um, $2, or it's going to come down to $4.49, and you can actually get this online too. Um, you can save $2 online if you uh, enter the code RIMMEL2 at checkout, and then if you have a Target red card, you're going to get free shipping plus an additional 5%. So, um, seeing as a lot of the different contour palettes, the higher end contour palettes, range anywhere from $35 to $50, I thought that this was going to be an interesting, um, I thought that this was going to be a good product to pick up since it is fairly inexpensive. And from the other Rimmel Cosmetics that I have tried, I have really liked, um, such as the Stay Matte Powder. I love that powder. Uh, they have a great line of lipsticks. So I was browsing through Target like I do on a normal basis and I came across this one. So <clears throat> I'll go ahead and show you guys more of the packaging. So this product comes with a highlighter, a contour and sculptor and a blush. And I will go ahead and do some swatches on my arm. So, just going off of swatches here, the pigmentation, as you can see, is not that great. So, I'm going to then, with more force here, swatch on my next arm. I'm already thinking this is not going to be a good product because the pigmentation on these are just... As you can see, the pigmentation on these are very, very muted. So um, that's a bit disappointing. So here's another swatch right here. So I'm just gonna, so now I'm gonna go ahead and um, test the product out to um, see how everything goes. And on the back of the package, it actually gives you a, um, it's, it's, oh, what am I trying? On the back of the packaging, it actually has an illustration of how you can use the product in terms of the highlight, contour, and um, blush. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a, um, so I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the demo of the product and show you guys um, how it applies. Okay, so I didn't realize I wasn't recording. So um, as you can see, I already started making my um, contour marks. I'm just following the diagram. Don't worry, I'm gonna blend this in, guys. I'm not gonna leave it like this. Um, but I wanted just to mention that I'm noticing that um, the pigmentation on my face is actually um, a lot better than my actual swatches. So, um, that's a good thing. And I have been using the um, Sonia Kashuk contour brush to really pick up the product. And then now I'm gonna blend the contour all out with my um, Real Techniques um, 
blush brush, which I highly recommend this brush. I love it. I use it for my blush and I use it for um, what I'm doing right now, contour and uh, bronzer. So I'm just going to blend all of that in and get rid of that line I made. So overall, the product is blending in really nicely into my skin and it's giving me that really nice um, contour edge right here. So I'm liking the color and I'm also liking how the product blends. So I'm gonna zoom you guys in so you can kind of like, I'm really liking um, one thing with this product that you guys are gonna need to do is you're really, really gonna need to blend it in because I'm noticing that um, or maybe just use less of the product. So um, just be uh, careful with that if you are to use this product. And then I'm just gonna pick up um, a little bit more of the contour shade just to add a little bit more warmth to my face. So I'm just gonna add, like I said, I'm just adding a little bit more. Okay, so that is the bronzed part of my face. I don't really do this part and I don't bronze my nose as much, but I don't really bronze my chin very often. So the next thing I'm going, so next I'm going to go ahead and go in with the blush. And there's not really a color name on the blush, but it is just a pink peach color right here. Um, and it's a matte shade too, so there's no shimmer in this blush. So I'm just going to pack some on my blush. I love blush so much. It's probably one of my favorites next to highlight powders. So I'm just gonna add the blush shade on. And again, I'm using my Real Techniques blush brush. And there's actually an Ibotta for the uh, Real Techniques blush brushes. So if you guys are looking to get Real Technique brushes, you can get them at um, Ulta. You can get them at, I got mine at Kohl's actually. Uh, you can also get them at Bed Bath & Beyond and you can use your 20% um, off coupons and you can get these 20%. You could also use the Ulta store coupons, but I, hi, I know this video is about Rimmel, but I just, I really wanna rave about my Real Techniques blush brush so overall I think that the blush color it's okay it's not my favorite it doesn't give um, a lot of uh, it does not give a lot of pigmentation but um, I'm one that likes more blush color um, on my face maybe than most people I just I really really love my blush um, so I'm not really a fan of the blush and then the last thing I'm gonna go in is with the highlight and this highlight has a little bit of sheen to it, obviously, because it's a highlighter. Um, but the shade has a little, it's kind of like a yellow gold um, undertone. So it's a really nice, neutral, warm highlight, I guess you could say. So I'm gonna go ahead in with my Real Techniques, what is this? I'm not a, oh, it's a setting brush. So I use the setting brush to apply my highlighter. So I will zoom back in and show you guys the highlight right here. And this is just a very subtle, subtle highlight. So this is a very, so this is a very subtle highlighter here. So it's not, it's not on point to say Jaclyn Hill's um, Champagne Pop or uh, another one that I use a lot is the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea um, highlighter. I love that one. Um, this is just going to be a very, very um, light um, highlight here. So you're not gonna get that full on psh, highlight with this. So um, just keep that in mind. Um, you know, the highlighter is really not um, doing much for me. So 
um, when I go out later, I'm probably going to apply a different highlight. So that was the, um, the first impression. So I'm going to go ahead and um, give a little more um, thoughts on the product with you guys. So my honest opinion on this Rimmel Contour Sculptor Palette, I think that you can pass on this. Um, the $2 saved, I think, would be um, better spent on a different product. So I highly recommend, if you want to use this um, $2 off Target coupon, I highly recommend that you check out either the Stay Matte Powder or the Stay Matte Bronzer. I really like those two products. Um, but yes, I was very disappointed um, with this little palette. I was looking forward to it because like I said I really enjoy Rimmel cosmetic um, items but um, out of the three I only really cared for the contour shade. I will say that for my fair skin it was a really nice um, shade but overall uh, the highlighter and the blush just did nothing for me so um, if I I probably will pass this on to someone else and maybe they can give it a try. Um, this may sound weird, but if any of you are um, interested in this, then I will go, <laughs> I'll just go ahead and mail it to you. Um, I've only used it once, so uh, I guess first person in the comments to say that they want this, I'll just go ahead and mail it to you. Um, so that is my review, first impression on the Rimmel Sculptor palette. So if you see this in Target, eh, you can pass on it. Um, but if you guys try it out and you like it, let me know. And I hope you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I look forward to doing more of these in the future because as couponers, we get tons of coupons, especially for beauty related items. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel. The link is down below. Don't forget to don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it and I will talk to you guys all later and also I have been working really hard on my website GinaSchweppe.com so I'm gonna leave a link below um, in the description box and you can go ahead and enter your email and you'll be notified every time I make a post I make a lot of deal posts but I also do makeup reviews on my blog as well so um, if you're someone that really enjoys makeup reviews, you should definitely check out my blog. So I will talk to you guys all later. Bye.